Hello everybody, Zoe on low here. Welcome back to Super Mario 64. Um, if you guys are new around here, be sure to like and subscribe. It does help the channel and all that. So, okay, where did we leave off? We need two more stars to get to the new... Oh no, we have to do that one thing first. Dude, there's something um, I kind of forgot about because I was playing this in between. This is a kind of, uh... Do shit, and I kind of missed stoked one up part for like DS version. I don't know why I do that a lot because I I play both versions constantly. Like I said, Mario 64 is one of those games. Like I'm not good at it. I feel like I should be with the amount of time I put into this. I don't want to check the Wii U pad. And even when I had All Stars, I think I beat Mario uh, Galaxy. And then I just kept playing Mario 64. I didn't even finish Sunshine. I stepped. That's one. Uh, that and Galaxy 2 is the only 3D Mario games I still haven't completed. Ooh, I can talk to you now. Hey, buddy. Hey, I've prepared the cannon for you. Oh, thank you. You're a little gorgeous lad, aren't you? You're so cute. Oh my god, do they sell like pink bob still? Or one of those characters they just don't acknowledge anymore. The DS era was the death of a lot of Nintendo characters, let's be honest, from the Mario universe. When was the last, when was the last time Toadsworth appeared? Like, it's weird, I always knew about that character, but growing up, I don't think there was a game besides like the Mario and Luigi games. Or any of... Actually, he only appeared in Spin Off. Never mind. I can't think of anything outside of Sunshine he appears in besides Mario DS when he's in the little mushroom houses. Hold on, I'm just getting, getting, uh, making sure I know button combinations. Can you tell what star I'm going for? Comment down. <gasps> no! This ain't the DS version, that would've been death. Dude, I, I, I get so fucking lucky at times, it's unbelievable. There's a lot of like, of those stores, like Nintendo store, the Pokemon store, there was a lot more of that. Like there's one, like I said, there's one in a fucking New York, that's the one I know of. And uh... I just kind of wish there was shit in Michigan. Here we go. That makes it sound like there's nothing to do. Um, but... And, and the best part about that, it was like a fucking missing, but... Oh, you've recovered 30 stars, you can go to the drown room. No, the drown room's in uh, the room next to me. If I try to say the name of that stage, I'm gonna get it wrong. I get confused with one other stage. Jolly Roger Bay is down here. I don't know, Jolly Roger Bay. It's weird. I always thought. Hold on, I might be wrong. So on this, hold on. We'll enter the room first. Don't want to look like an idiot. Dire dire dogs. Oh, no, Jolly Roger Ray is the one upstairs. Oh, okay. Okay, so, I don't... Okay, so if we, uh... Dude, uh, girl, when I was little, playing this game, because I remember when I first, uh, beat this, I was so happy. But afterwards, um, after you beat Bowser, I would always, uh, fucking go to this level in particular, and, uh, the one was drop, uh, the ship. And I would always act like a fucking Mario was like a little pirate. 
Dude, it's weird. Odyssey almost does that itch for me. If only there was a pirate ship I can, like, stay on. Dude, since, uh, what's it called? It's coming to place, uh, see if Thieves says it's coming to PlayStation, which... Weird-ass timeline we're in. By the way. Dude... Um, this is all, almost the perfect, uh... How many 3D games are we... Mario 3D games are we missing on here, besides... This is the most interesting console generation, because people are already kind of comparing it to, like, the Wii and shit, which is, uh... I'm pretty much a Wii GameCube Xbox original era. That's where I started. I had the original Xbox and all of that. And dude, I love the original Xbox. Like I talk shit about Microsoft a lot, but that's more of their more uh well, I guess Xbox, Microsoft. I don't know, I kind of consider them different entities sometimes because like when I think of Microsoft, I think of computers. When I think of Xbox, I think of shitty games. Or, I mean, shitty consoles. Their games aren't shitty. They just don't use a lot of their good IPs anymore because they kind of fucked up midway. There ain't 100 coins here. Why am I trying to get them? Know your place! Where did I miss one? Like I said, I get lucky. You fucking bitch! Oh shit, he's gonna catch up to me, holy fuck. That was intense. Uh, oh, okay. Breaking out here. I thought I was a bit early on that. I was gonna fucking hit the roof of the thing. Oops. Wait, that helps. Well, not really. Oh, no. I want my butt to be spicy. No, the Switch is almost the perfect console for me because, uh, it almost has all the 3D Mario games. We're only missing Mario, uh, 2, honestly. And, and if you want to get technical, I guess we're missing Luigi's Mansion 1. That is so weird! Especially since we have two now on here. But anyway, I think we're gonna... I honestly think we're gonna get another year of Switch before, uh... People are saying 2025, but with the way things have been going, also I don't trust fucking leakers and shit. I I'm gonna be hopefully wrong. I'm just hoping it does have backwards compatibility. If it doesn't, I might be holding on off of it for a minute. I didn't come back here because I forgot uh, a coin. I didn't even... I would have been completely fucking lost if I didn't get that. Okay, cool. Mario, the famous stripper. Be spicy! No! Alright, we're back.
Bowser has come for the one, so bad. Oh, wait. Uh, you ain't gonna get me. I don't know why, um, hold on. Is this three hits or one? I forget. I think it's three hits or one. It's B, right? Fuck! I was a bit off. Just a bit. Dude, I really want to get him in there. I know I can do that shit. It's just like... It's just a bit off there. Jeez. It's so weird in the skybox. I have never, like, noted the little... Uh, imperfections there. God. Why'd you sit my butt up? I, I don't want to be all... from this distance while here. Oh. So what? I can't say that. Oh no, he's coming for my ass. Oh god. Oh shit, I forgot he can teleport. Dude, um... I prefer the DS version only because like the mo uh, Bowser's model is better in that version. Um... It's weird, I don't think the uh, Mario and those, like, I don't, okay, they don't look bad, but I think I prefer the N64 version. Because it's less pixelated, I guess. I kind of hope they kind of, if they ever do uh, something with Mario 64 again, I hope they kind of take the faces uh, of the DS remake. And, um, just add a bunch of different shit. That's what I think they should do with like these reimagining the shit games. Like add more to it. They don't have to be canon. But in the, like if if you're worried about people cleaning up the canon, put it in like let's say you have a DLC. Say it's not canon or whatever. Dude, I was disappointed when uh, Superstars gave us that shadow costume. Not a $60 game, by the way, um, anyway, that's besides the point, uh, but they didn't just give, they didn't give a shadow, they just gave him a, 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 a class of Sonic in pajamas, like, you have the rabbit there, he's not, th like, that's literally a reference to your old spreadsheets you had, like, when you were coming up with these characters, you couldn't have added shadow, really? I think it comes with these old stupid rules they have and probably still have like, oh, like, uh, you can't have classic shadow. Like, we don't need classic shadow. You just, just, you could have just added shadow. A lot of characters you can. Or just add their modern versions. I can go upstairs now. And that's what I would do. I guess this is technically the first console, for at least for America, where we got both versions of the uh, of the game. Of the Japanese version. Technically, uh, we have the original Japanese version, the original Mario version, and then the All-Stars version, which kind of does the Japanese version. We can't do the BL. Oh, God damn, it was going. I have never- I, I can BLJ on the other thing, no problem with that, I still have a problem with. So I guess I'll just give up on that for now, I'm not gonna do it anytime soon. Thank you, Toadie. Okay. Yay! This is my favorite level. Sucks, I think they fucked it up in the DS version. Because every time, 
with now a doubt, it'll probably happen when I do my, uh, when I do a Let's Play of that version of the game, too, but whenever I, uh, you know, I think it's just best to show, you know, instead of trying to explain it. If I like the aesthetic, like, of this one, like, with the mushrooms and shit, like I said, I would love to have, like, a reimagining of shit. But this is one of those 3D games I wouldn't mind because it's not that open. I'm still trying to look for uh, an open world game like I genuinely like. This something like you know besides Odyssey, I guess. Dude, I didn't even know. Uh, um, I guess I'll do the level the actual way you're supposed to, but I also kind of want to do it where, uh, I just, I'll, I'll do it the actual way, but, just know there's more than one. Oh, I thought that was a fuck up. Okay, I did not know this thing is a painting. I did not know that was a fucking thing until you... I want to say six years ago now. Pro I found that out when I was 17. And I was surprised. I, oh, I, I've seen this, like, pictures of this level. But I never, like, thought it was, like, a part of the game. I thought it was, like, one of those fan things for some reason. And I'm like, wait, what, that was actually in the game? And I just Ooh. never done it? Yeah. It is so weird to me. I guess I'll do it the way I want it to now. Oh no, okay, cool. Oh, there's a secret combination over there. I want if I die again, let's see if I can do that. Let's see if I can remember that on the top of my head. Did this track, Jolly Rogers Bay's track and uh, the Bowser theme are my top three Mario songs. In like the franchise, here's the thing, I don't think there's actually a Mario tune, besides probably some shit in 3 in a world, that I like more than Mario 64's soundtrack. Oh, well, those three songs. It's weird, I don't care for Bob on Battlefield, and that's one of the more popular ones too. But usually, the way I usually do this level, in particular, I usually, um, wall j uh, kick in. But you, you see where I could have done it. In the DS version, they put a fucking cage there. Because they're pansies. Nothing more! Woo. Yeah, I love this Mario game. Uh, this and Odyssey, I love game, uh, platformers where you have so much fucking freedom. That's kind of, I think that's why the 3D uh, platformer genre died. Because Mario and Odyssey, uh, 64 and Odyssey are probably one of the better examples of like, how to do a 3D platformer. I think Banjo and uh, Crash are good examples too. I actually, I like, uh, I played a bit of the Insane Trilogy. I haven't played the original. I know it had its issues because, uh, I think Crash 1 didn't have, uh, which is weird to think about because I'm like, huh. I, I, I kind of think of PlayStation 4, their L3 and R3 button, like those extra ones. Like, I think of that as a part of the controller. It's, like, it's, it's iconic. But... No, I have a bunch of fucking, uh, PlayStation 1 and 2 controllers that just don't have, I don't, I don't think PlayStation 2, I think PlayStation 2 is the one that actually started the whole, uh, let's have those extra buttons for movement. I wonder if, uh, Nintendo, if Mario 64, like, actually reached its, uh, peak, like, they had all the ideas, they didn't have to scrap anything. Like, here's the thing, there's 
like that one uh, enemy in that was supposed to be, I guess, in that lava area. Like he's one of those things that don't make sense to cut because, and I think it was because he was too similar to the bullies or some shit. But he's way cooler than the bullies, so it's like I don't know. Did, it, did people find out what it, the character's name is? Also, the lava creature from World Up was in the game. You can do that from like Game Shark, so I'm pretty sure. One of these days, I'll pick up a Game Shark when he has 64. See how that works. Now. I want to get a lot of those older things too. Like I haven't, and like I have a GameCube now. I don't have uh, wires for it though. Also, uh, my AV cables to my N64 are kind of like. And I think like rats chewed on them three years ago, but I still had them, even though there's like probably like the yellow and the the color ones you need for sound. I only have one of those. It sucks because I have a CRTV downstairs. Um, it sadly doesn't work. Fuck, I found that out recently. <sighs> Eventually. No. That's not where I meant to go. That's not where I even wanted to go. I want to scale the top again. Okay. Oh, I have to wait for the penguin. This is bullshit. Why don't you let me at pass? I don't get it. Why are you so dickish? Yeah. You bitch! Dude, I always, I remember uh, trying to hit this fucker for the longest time. Here's the thing, I didn't register, uh, I never read dialogue growing up. I thought he was a fucking stalker. Because, like, he still appears in the game in one level. That you can actually, like, beat his ass and shit. He's weird. Yeah. Anyway, I'm gonna end the episode here, though. Um... Hope you all have enjoyed. Be sure to like and subscribe. Share this with your friends and all that. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.